Hello there. I'm just filming a Muscovy duck here in a public park, pampering itself. Well, there's two Muscovy ducks in this park actually, because huh, here's the other one on a picnic table. <laughs> now, that's something you don't usually see very often. Now back to this one, I think. Hmm. Yeah, the Muscovy duck is a large species of duck. Hmm. They're much larger than any other species of duck. And even though I'm filming these two in a public park, hmm. well, the Muscovy duck is actually a tropical bird. They are originating in the tropics of Mexico, Central America and South America and it is one of only two species of duck that have been domesticated the other duck being the mallard by the way and Muscovy ducks have been domesticated for centuries and have been introduced into other parts of the world mainly as domestic birds of course but feral populations have been established in North America and in some parts of Europe now, feral means that hmm, they were once domestic animals and have either been del deliberately rele released into the wild or have actually escaped from their owners hmm. These two here that I'm filming, uh, that one over there, and this one, uh, uh, these two are probably feral D Muscovy ducks. Hmm. Now, true wild Muscovy ducks are usually uh, black with white patches on their wings. Yeah. But uh, as you can see, these two are black and white, and and domestic, or in this case, <laughs> feral Muscovy ducks can come in a variety of colours, from either black and white like these two, or even brown and white. Even though the Muscovy duck is a tropical bird, they have actually adapted well to temperature climates. And, and just like the mallard, the female Muscovy duck t takes care of the young on her own, and the male takes no part. Right, I think that's about it from now. Well, thanks for joining me, people, and I'll see you next time.